five minutes since I've done a video for you. I want to start with a stretch, um, and then we'll just keep moving and see where it leads us. All right? But we're going to start on your back. All right, dogs. Up you go. All right. So hold it here. Slowly lower yourself all the way down. Hey, 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 hey. All right, so hold on to your legs and just slowly descend to the mat. So you're all the way down on your back. Palms are up, collarbones are wide. Nice, just breathe in the nose and out the mouth. Get yourself here in the nose and exhale it out. You know what, send your legs long. Let's work uh, toes to head. So arms are long by your side, legs are long, healthier. And let's just flex and point your feet. Flex and point. That's it. I love you too. So you gotta step aside. Walk, walk, walk. Flex and point your feet, guys. Circle the ankles around. Circle them the other way. Truman, leave her alone. Kennel, go to the kennel. Kennel. Go to your kennels. So we're still circling those ankles. And then stop that. Bring a foot in, bring a foot in. Okay? Nice. So nestle that pelvis into that mat and just give yourself a little bridge. And then roll it down. And again, just bridge right up. And down you're going to go. And one more bridge up. And down you're going to go. Nice. Now stay right here. Let's simply um, take your feet about, no, take your right ankle onto your left thigh. Right ankle, left thigh, you hold here. And just sway the shape side to side. That's it. Just a nice little sway. I guess we call this an active stretch. Good. Nice. Okay, so we kind of went a little fast there. Now let's stay here. Everybody take the shape, everybody, you and me, take the shape to the left. And just enjoy that stretch there. Your right foot might go to the floor. And then bring it back up. Take that same shape to the right. And just enjoy that right there. And bring it right back up. Okay, switch your sides out. Good. So left ankle's on the right thigh. And I'm just going to sway side to side. Just kind of baby stepping it, getting used to it. Chest is open. There you go. Just sway. All right. And then we're going to stop that. And let's take this shape, same shape to the right. Notice the, the left foot could be on the floor and just kind of hang out there. And then bring it back. Take that same shape to the left. Ah, nice. Just kind of hang out right there. Feel that stretch there, that right side. Nice, and then come right back, okay? Take that left foot right off. Take the arms long by your side. Nice, now from here, just give yourself a bridge just to even these out. And then down you're gonna go. Now, from here, shrug your shoulders, push your shoulders away from your ears, and lift the head, neck, and shoulders up. And then down you're gonna go. Again, shrug, push the shoulders down, lift the head, neck, and shoulders up. And again, one more time. Shrug, push the shoulders down, lift the head, neck, and shoulders up. Stay right here, circle those arms right behind your head so your head is supported. You could also take your mat and just be like that. It's kind of nice, okay? Now hold it here, right leg goes long, kick it, lower it, and bring it in. Left leg long, kick it, lower, bring it in. Long, kick it, lower, bring it in. One more, long, and kick it, and lower, and bring it in. Nice, lift up, and then you're down. And again, lift, and you're down. Two more, lift, and you're down. One more, lift, and stay. Rotate everything to the right. Come back to center. Rotate the other direction. Come back to center. Rotate, come on back, and last time, rotate, come on back, and then lower it all down. Good, let your arms go by your side, but then they're gonna come right up to the ceiling, and let's just scissor them up and down. Good. Nice, so notice how it feels on the mat, and you're breathing, super, and then stop that. Now hold the arms um, up to the ceiling, and your legs are back. Send the right arm long and the left leg long. And then pull back in. Left arm, right leg. Keep this arm here. 
Yeah, that's the hard part. And you're there. And pull it back. And you're there. And pull it back. And you reach, reach, reach. Feels really good. And reach, reach, reach. And then come back. Hold here. Nice. Now, take the arms overhead and the legs are long. So the arms are lying there. Now, right arm comes in, left leg comes in, and then it goes back. And then you're here and back. So just opposition. Nice. It's like doing a bird dog, isn't it? But you're on your back. And again, you're here and long. And one more here. And then you're long. And then just enjoy that pencil stretch. Perfect. Take your legs about as wide as the mat. You can feel the edge. Okay. Take your right ankle over your left ankle. Grab your right wrist and side bend. Just give yourself that crescent stretch on the mat. Bring everything back to center, okay? Find that wide position for your legs. Left ankle crosses the right. Grab the left ankle or left wrist. Did I say ankle before? Anyway, and side bend. Just a good old stretch, just like that. And then come back, um, uh, cross those legs. Take the arms right up to the sky. Slide your legs in. Nice, hold here. Now let's do this. Lift the head, neck, and shoulders. Take the hands behind your head. Hold here. Now, flex your, flex your legs strongly and legs open and just close. Open and close. Hopefully you can kind of glide like I am. And again, open and close. Notice as you're doing this open, close, low, do both legs go open the same? Does one come in closer or faster? Are they meeting back at center? And then stop that, rest. Keep your hands where they are, okay? Let's take one leg up, take another leg up. Same idea, right, if the legs are in the air, and just open and close. But boy, does it feel differently, doesn't it? And close, and just open and close. Feel that stretch there, and you're parallel. Open and close, go one more. Nice, now go heels in. Open, oh yeah. And notice you feel one leg stretching, you know, maybe the inner thigh is tighter on one side than the other. And open and close. Open and close. One more. Ah, maybe just hang out there for a sec. And then close it. Okay, turn your leg parallel. Take a foot down, take a foot down. Lift the head, neck, and shoulders. Reach those arms long and give yourself a rest. Okay, now. Arms are by your side. So this one we're gonna kind of flow from to one side from one side to the other. Take your feet about as wide as your mat. Legs are gonna stay bent, okay? Both knees are gonna fall to the right. Left arm goes overhead. Okay, I'll cue this left to right. And just relax into it. Kind of stay there. Nice. And then when you're ready, you're gonna roll onto that right shoulder. So you're here. Okay, but you're still in that same position, right? Correct? All right, so just enjoy that. Maybe take the left arm overhead and feel that stretch there. I feel it like right in there. Okay, then when you're ready, use that top hand. You're gonna push yourself right up to see this. So we come up to this same Z sit position. I want you to reach to the left, towards the back leg, and then you're gonna reach over, just like that. And we reach, good. And then we're gonna push. Now, this time, reach side bend here, set that arm down, and you're gonna lift your hips. And then kind of back bend here. And then you'll come down. And then again, you'll side bend. And come back, and there you go. This is Secret. Yeah, she's named Secret. Well, I think the kids named her Secret for Victoria's Secret, but back in the day, but she does hide really well. And then come back down, perfect. Hold yourself here. Think we're, are we even? Think we're even. Nice, now from here, you're just gonna pop those knees up. You're here, they're wide, and they go the other way. Okay, why don't we take the hands back behind you? So you're gonna go here, and here, and here, and here, and here. Just letting that knee drop, guys. You're here, and here. And here, and here. Good, couple more. Nice, and that's gonna be your last one. So we end where we kind of started at the seated position. 
then you're gonna allow your body all the way down, right? Correct? Okay, then um, go ahead and stack up your knees so they're in this nice kind of fetal position, but it's 90. Take both arms long, okay? Top arm is just gonna open like a book. And then you come back. And again, top arm opens, oh yeah. And then you come back. And again, top arm opens. Then you're gonna come back, and last time, top arm open, stay, and bring both knees up. Nice, and then you kind of resituate. Arms are long by your side. Tuck your tail and give yourself a bridge. And down you're gonna go. And again, bridge up. And down, and give you one more, bridge. And then go down, okay, nice. So again, we repeat on the other side. I turned around so you can see clearly. Take your feet about as wide as the mat. Pull here, let both knees sway to the left. Take the right arm overhead, and you're just gonna hang out. You're just gonna stay right here. All right, just take a couple breaths, feel a stretch there on that right side, or if for you, it might be the other side. Kind of keep it. And when you're ready, you're gonna roll right on that left shoulder. So just roll like so, just like that. So you're here, you're in that same position, right? Nice. And then you're gonna push yourself all the way up. And here you are again, sitting in the Z set. Okay? So first, just a couple regular mermaids. We go towards the back leg and we go away. Right, and I think like for me, the second side right away, I feel a little bit more open. Good. Not that this side is more open, but I've already stretched it kind of on the other side, right? All right, nice. Now let's go side bend. You're gonna plant that left hand and then you're gonna lift. And then down you're gonna go and side bend. Oh yeah. I kind of brace a little bit on this leg and then I'm down. And then I lift. And again, down I go. And over here. Good. And then I lift. Nice. And that's that, right? I'm pretty sure that's as many as I did. Now from here, you're just gonna take your body all the way back down. Okay. Take the arm in front, take that top, that top leg back to the front. So you're here. Okay? Top arm is gonna open. And then you come back. And again, you open. And then you come back. And again, you open. Feel that stretch there. Oh. And then you're going to come back. And how about one more? Nice. Open. Hold for a sec. And then bring those knees right back with you. And of course, you got to kind of readjust on this mat. All right, so arms are by your side, and again, just bridge up, and then go down. And again, bridge up, and down, and just go one more. And go down, perfect. Send your legs long, okay? Lift your face, you're looking towards your toes. Take a breath, and exhale, get you right up. Now you're sitting up nice and tall. I just want you to take whatever legs in front and open it wide. So now here we are seated, okay? Facing front, okay? So let's just do a little side bend here because we kind of know it. Okay, we know that, right? All right, nice. Now from here, take those arms to the side. I want you to take your right arm inside. Now I did this the other day in class with the gliding disc. It was awesome. And we can do the same thing without a disc. So left arm goes high. You're just gonna side bend like that. So I'm pushing the bottom arm away and I'm reaching with the top arm. And then come up. And again, reach. And then I come up. And then again, I reach. And then I come up and go one more. Reach, just like that. Nice. Now from here, Take your right hand to your right leg. So now you're rotated and reach down on. 
that back arm. And then you're gonna come up top. And you go right into saw. And then come back up. And again, you reach. And then you're up. And one more. You reach. And then you're up. And then relax. Perfect. Okay? Now let's try the other side. So, other hand, left hand for me, it's gonna be here. Other arm, right arm goes high. And first I just do two side bends here with both arms just kind of reaching away. And I come back. And I reach. And I come back. Now on this one, I go for that reach. Then my left arm comes to my left leg and I rotate. And there I am. And then my left arm goes back. So there I am here. Now I'm in a saw. And then I come up tall. And then I saw both arms are reaching through that twist. My legs are a little wide for a normal saw, but that's okay. You're there. And come up. And go one more. You're there. And then you come up. And then relax those arms. Nice. Now from here, tuck under and just bring these legs in. Okay, so you're seated. I learned this sequence from Jenna Safino. Yeah, it's really kind of cool. I like it. So arms are going to reach. We get into the back, the hips a little bit. You're going to round, and then you're going to open. And again, just round, and then you open. Now let's add the legs. You're going to round, and then you're going to open. And again, we round, and you curl back, and then you open. I might even flip my wrist back, and again, I round it in, and then I open, and one more round it in, and then I open. Now, could I take this on an angle? Sure. So I round in. And then I angle it. And I round in. And I angle it. Good. Round in. And then angle it. And one more. Round in. And then you angle it. Nice. Take both arms to center. They go high. And just forward fold. Forward fold right there, guys. Just kind of settle in. Notice how you feel here. Walk your hands in. Perfect. Nice. Now from here, take that. Um, well, let's take, take the other leg. Slide it over and flip over to all fours. That kind of worked, right? Okay, so you're at all fours now. Knees are right under your hips. I got this nice seam on my pants so you can really see it. Hands are right under the shoulders. Abdominals are engaged. Okay, hold here. From here, why don't we a nice basic push up? So booty doesn't change. You just lower and lift and lower, right? You gotta start somewhere with your push-ups. Good. And again, lower and lift. And lower and lift. And lower. Good. And lower. And go one more. And then lift. Now, a cool, another variation of a push-up is take your hands forward. Right? So they're not right in line with my shoulders. I'm here. Probably a little bit more forward. And then I'm gonna dip down and lift, and dip, and lift, and dip, and lift, and dip, and lift. Again, dip, and lift. Keep going, let's go four more. Let's go three, let's go two, and let's go one. Nice, and then walk your hands back. Let's close that, just round your back. Come through and go off that arch. And again, tuck your tailbone, push the floor away. Come through an arch. And one more time, tuck under. And give yourself that stretch there too. Good. Hold right here, guys. Nice. And now just take your right arm to the side. Lift it. Notice how well it lifts here. And then you're just going to thread through. Drop your head, shoulder. Reach that left arm. Maybe your ab. <laughs> okay. So you're here, and if you want, you could extend your left leg out, okay? And if you want, you could lift up the left leg, maybe. Take that left leg down, slide that left leg in, enjoy the stretch, slide the left arm in, bring yourself back. Round your back, drop your head. Come through and arch. All right, just some active stretching here, guys. Okay, let's try the other side. Left arm lifts. Notice where does it go? And then you thread through. Down you go. Head is down. Shoulder is down. Right arm goes to the top of your mat. There you are. Then if you want, you extend your right leg long. 
Okay? Then if you want more, up goes that right leg. There it is. Right foot can go down. Nice. Slide the right foot in. Slide the right hand in. And bring yourself right back to all fours. And again, round your back. Come through and go over that arch. Perfect. Okay, good. Let's stop that. Okay, curl your toes under. Uh, no, let's take one leg back. Take another leg back. Find your plank. Up goes your hips. Okay, drop those heels. Come right back to a plank. Right, nothing has to change, right? You just lift up your hips. Drop your heels. And then you come back. Nice. Now, slide your left foot in a bit. Right leg extends. Give it a lift. Go for that big old stretch. But then, guys, the right knee's going to come right in between the hands. And just sit in your pigeon. However that is. Mine's not great. Okay? So find your pigeon. You're up nice and tall. And then, starting from the low belly, drape over that leg. Slowly walk your hands out. In here, and just rock side to side. Yeah. But really use your body weight to go side to side. All right, slide a hand in, slide a hand in, and then roll yourself right up. Okay, curl the left toes under. You're gonna push that right leg straight up to the ceiling. Ah, take that right foot down. Find your plank again. Or front support. Then again, guys, right foot slides in, left leg is long, left leg goes up. Oh, it goes out of frame. There's that belly. And then left knee comes right in. Perfect. Relax into this. Good. Let's hold right there. Good. Rise up to your fingertips and again drape over. And then reach your arms long. Good, you just let your body sway side to side. Oh yeah, good. That was a nice surprise where I feel that sometimes, yeah, I feel inner thighs, sometimes piriformis here. Sometimes for my shoulders. Stop that, slide the hand in, slide the hand in. Roll yourself up, curl the right toes under. Left foot gets a sheet up there. Left leg, take that left foot down. Come to a plank, drop down to your knees, and again, just sit back. Feel that leg. Push the mat away from you. Maybe take your hand back, take your hand back, and surrender all the way into this child pose. Nice. Take your hand um, by your knee, hand by your knee. Start to roll up a bit. Lift up your touch, curl your toes under, rock back to your feet. So just be in this stretch right here. Nice. Feel the back there. And even right here, you can lift your heels. And then drop your heels. And again, lift. And again, lower. And go one more. Nice lift. And nice lower. Perfect. Hands on that floor. Take those hips up. Take them down. And just one more. Up they go. Hold right here, guys. Now I'm going to come out of frame, but slowly roll yourselves all the way up, all the way, all the way, all the way, all the way. You're up. Tip your chin. Roll yourself down. Walk your hands out. Come down to your knees. Come to seated. Seated. Cross your ankles. Okay? So be right here. Let's just close this out, guys. So you're going to round, and then you're going to lift. Just do two. Okay? Nice. Now take your right arm up, take her back, take your left arm up, and just give yourself a twist. And then come back to center. And now switch across your ankles. Two times. Round. And then lift. And one more. And lift. Take your left hand back, take the right arm up, give yourself a good old twist right there, guys. And then come back to center. Take a deep breath up. Dive forward. Roll yourself up, switch across your ankle. Again, deep breath up, and then just dive forward. Roll yourself right up, guys. Nice. So for those shoulders back, we turn that head side to side. Nice. And now you're ready to get up and go. So 
As you're getting up, notice which leg you get up on and maybe switch it out. Like for me, I probably want to come up on my right, so I'm going to go ahead and switch it out. I'm going to put my left foot forward, arms are going to reach, and you guys know the drill because the video's ending. You're going to lean back, take an inhale, you're going to come up. Thanks guys, and we're all done. Have a great day.